I'm ready. Let's go to Harbor Town. Stay behind me. All right? The island is full of dangers. Even this lake down here. Stay on the walkway and you should be safe. Let's move on. This way, come on. Follow me. We have to move on. This way, come on. This is it. That way leads to the main gate of Harbour Town. I suggest you don't go down there, though. That will take you to the Warriors of the Order. You want to go to the Monastery to join the Order? Go that way. You don't want that? Don't go there, because they won't give you a choice. Thanks. I think I get the point. Let's go on. All right, we're moving. If you follow this path up, you'll end up at the monastery. But the sign will tell you that, right? That's what signs are for. Need me to guide you further? Yes, go on. Come on then. You'll have to make your own way to the rear entrance of the town, but it isn't much farther. From here, keep heading south through the narrow corridor. Keep going until you reach a high cliff, then follow that. It'll take you straight to the town gate. And I can just walk in? One of the town guards will probably be outside the gate, but I'm sure you can find a way to convince the sentry to let you pass. Convince them? How do I do that? If you have enough gold on you, I'm sure that will help persuade him. That's how the old guards seem to work. Corruption is everywhere. I see. Now I need to get back to my grain field. Good luck. are real, right? Of course I'm real. Sorry, sorry. It's becoming harder and harder to tell these days. Who are you? The name's, uh, Leon. You seem a little nervous, Leon. What are you doing out here in the wilderness? Just looking for a bite to eat. Sure that's all you're doing? Of course. I'm a hunter. I am. Just 
you know, hunting. You don't look like a hunter. I can't help how I look. Come on, what are you really doing out here? Okay, okay. So I'm a treasure hunter, seeker. I heard that the ruins are full of stuff. And so I set out to get my share. I even got myself a shovel and a pickaxe. Cut the crap. I can tell you're lying. You're really not going to let this rest, are you? Not a chance. Okay, okay. But you won't believe the truth either. Just before the Order locked up Harbour Town, I started getting nightmares. Then it got worse. I started seeing these apparitions, hearing this whispering inside my head. I escaped town, but it's no better out here. I haven't slept properly for ages. The whispering, always the whispering. These apparitions, these restless ghosts, they won't leave me alone. Can you tell me something else about these ghosts? I'm telling the truth here. Spend the night if you don't believe me. I'd love to see your face when the ghost of Lord Patrascon appears. What can you tell me about Lord Patrascon? When he comes to me, I can hear this horrible, whispering voice inside my head. He says terrible things. Terrible, terrible things. Do you have any idea where these ghosts come from? No. Well, in my dreams, I see towers. There's a ruined tower north of here, and there are more on the west coast. Perhaps they come from those. If they've singled you out, then you must have done something. I found this strange ring in the forest. Found it. All right. I didn't steal it. It was just there. Been seeing them since then. Show me the ring. Here. That ring must have belonged to them, and the undead don't like their things being taken. Oh, crap. What do I do now? Maybe I can take care of these ghosts. Really? How will you do that? I'll go to the towers, see what I find there. That would be good. I don't know how much more of this I can take. Who does this hut belong to? Me. Well, me now. So you've taken it. You think it's okay to just steal someone's home? Hey, this island's been turned upside down. You see that, right? Besides, no one's bothered me. So the owner's either dead or he's been dragged off to the monastery. Sounds about right for this place. How did you get out of Harbour Town? I climbed over the town wall. It's that easy? Well, apart from stopping them seeing you do it, that goes without saying. A little more for me. Hmm. I need a shovel. Ah!
Hey, this area hasn't been secured yet. Be careful. Thanks. I'll keep my eyes open. Can't look after yourself, eh? I don't care what you're doing here or where you're from. I only care about security. Unauthorized people will be considered a looter. If I tell Severin at the farm or if he sees you, you'll be arrested instantly. This area is off limits. What do you know about this area? This camp's run by the Order for the Inquisition. What's the camp for? All the troops out here use it. They bring artifacts here and guard these two ruins. One here below the farm and another further up. Are the ruins dangerous? We've got creatures piling out of the ruins and spreading out everywhere. Can you tell me more about the ruins here? I can't really. I just stand guard here. If you want to know more, talk to Severin. Or rather, don't talk to him. You're not part of the Order. You're not authorized. Unless you want to join the Order, stay away from any white robes. I'm on my way to the town. You want to enter the town? Well, if you want that and don't want to get sent to the monastery by the Inquisition, don't go to the main gate. They'll catch you right away. There's a rear gate to the southeast. Leto's the guard there. Slip him a couple of gold pieces, he'll let you in. Thanks.
Who could teach me to pick locks? Hey, you! Don't you know it's forbidden to run around outside the town? Are you part of the town guard? That's right. I'm guarding the gate so no one can leave. Shouldn't you stand inside then? Well, I also have to stop people coming in. What if I want to get in? I'm sure we can come to an arrangement. Or would you rather go to the monastery? What's going on in the monastery? They say they do training. 
But everyone knows they enchant people up there. Enchant them? A couple of the boys, they took her back in town. Before, they didn't take the law seriously. Now they blindly follow the Inquisitor. If that's not enchantment, you explain it. Maybe they changed their minds. You might be able to change my mind with a couple of gold coins, but what the Inquisitor did with them... I'm telling you, he used magic on them. What are things like in the town? Used to be good, but since Don Esteban left, Inquisition's in charge now. Brought the farmers into town, then sealed the gates. That's the Inquisitor's new law. And Commandant Carlos has everyone who violates the law taken to the monastery. How much to let me in? Hundred gold coins, but you can't come and go as you like. Once you're in, you're in. You're asking for a lot of gold. Be glad I don't take twice as much to save you from the monastery. But I'm not an asshole. I'm willing to haggle. If you don't have enough gold, you can trade things instead. What can you tell me about Commandant Carlos? He's the new boss. He and his warriors of the Order try to keep law and order. They try? Well, the Don's men don't let them have it all their own way, right? Things are quiet now, but that could change any time. Tell me about Don Esteban. Great man, great man. Most people probably think he ran away from the Inquisition, but that's not true. No? No. He set up camp in the swamp to take gold out of the ruins himself. That's what this is all about. Gold. He left a couple of his men here to carry on his business while he gets his share. So the town has divided loyalties. You live here, you've got to choose. Stay loyal to the Don, to our people, or help the swanky bastards from the mainland. Of course, you can just keep your head down, try and keep out of trouble. Trouble finds people. If you say so. I just follow orders, mate. But trust me, you don't want to side with the Order. You want to help the Don. And you work for the Don? Me? No. I'm part of the town guard. And all citizens must do what Commandant Carlos says. And you don't like that? You can't cut deals with the warriors of the Order. The Don's men were always open to a good deal. You mean you could buy them off? Call it what you want. A deal is a deal. And everyone was happy.
I don't want to talk to you right now. Careful what you touch. This text is about magic spells. Smells good. Let's trade. All right, show me the way to your camp. 
Good man. Follow me. What are you waiting for? Come with me. What are you waiting for? Look to the north. You see the ruins sticking out of the ground? Yeah, I've seen ones like that before. Well, the White Robes set up a camp there. If you're smart, you won't be seen up there. Otherwise, you'll be snatched up and taken to the monastery. Do you want to be a slave or a free man? You're really hammering this home, aren't you? Ah, uh, sorry, sorry. You're right, you're your own man. Free to do what you like. Come on. It isn't much further. If you follow the path north, you'll come to our camp. And watch out for the hunters. The lazy beggars are always trying to get others to do their work for them. Thanks for your help. You've been through enough. You deserve a bit of kindness. I'm sure I'll see you around. Good luck. Ah! <laughs> 